The upcoming Knives Out sequel has another stacked cast, but it's the surprise cameos that are sure to get people talking. Who shows up? Will the film be darker than the first? Here's all you need to know before the big premiere. In November 2019, writer and director Ryan Johnson made waves with his murder mystery film Knives Out. The acclaimed Who Done It earned rave reviews and raked in a seriously impressive pull at the box office against a relatively modest budget, which is saying nothing of its multiple Golden Globe nominations. Luckily for all the legions of Knives Out fans out there, neither Craig nor Johnson hesitated to express their interest in revisiting Detective Benoit Blanc. In fact, during a pre-Golden Globes party held by Lionsgate in January 2020, Johnson told The Hollywood Reporter that he was already working on a script for a Knives Out sequel. Following the world premiere of Glass Onion at the 2022 Toronto International Film Festival, Johnson remarks that he'll keep making Knives Out sequels for as long as his star lets him. Via Variety, he joked, I'm going to keep making these until Daniel blocked me on his phone. It sounds crazy, but it'll work. However, despite how much he clearly enjoys making his Craig-led whodunits, Johnson did tell the Los Angeles Times that he found writing Glass Onion to be a particularly difficult experience. Johnson shared, It was scary. I also spent 10 years planning Knives Out, whereas this, I was kind of starting from scratch. Fortunately, if the film's overwhelmingly positive early reviews are any indication, it looks like Johnson already has the excuses he needs to keep making his Knives Out sequels. The main creative team members behind Knives Out began working on a sequel only a few months after the film's release, so it shouldn't come as much of a surprise to learn that Glass Onion, a Knives Out mystery, is set to be released relatively shortly. For his part, Daniel Craig likely had a little more time to spare for Glass Onion, too, given the fact that his tenure as James Bond came to an end in 2021 with no time to die. All of which to say that Knives Out fans don't have to wait much longer to see the follow-up to that beloved 2019 Who Done It. Indeed, Glass Onion is currently set to premiere Friday, December 23rd on Netflix. Ryan Johnson also announced on Twitter in early October that Glass Onion will be released in select theaters one month prior to its late December Netflix premiere. That means Knives Out fans will get the chance to see Glass Onion early, though the film is only set to play in theaters throughout the week of November 23rd. Glass Onion A Knives Out Mystery will tell a completely different story than its predecessor. According to Netflix's To Doom, Ryan Johnson's Knives Out sequel will be set in the Mediterranean and will follow Edward Norton's tech billionaire Miles Braun and the friends he invites to his private island in Greece. As you might have already guessed, one of these friends ends up dead, and it's Daniel Craig's Benoit Blanc who is ultimately tasked with discovering the identity of the victim's murderer. As was the case in Knives Out, the new film's wealthy central characters will all be far from perfect. While speaking with To Doom, Johnson even touched on the relationships at the center of Glass Onion, saying, It's structured around a group of friends, or frenemies, who all have a power dynamic with one of their successful friends. It begins with him sending an invitation for them to come and play this murder mystery game at this exotic locale. Fans will unfortunately have to wait to find out not only who the key victim is in Glass Onion, but who is ultimately responsible for their death. Really, Duke? Oh my god! Really? Knives Out boasted some pretty impressive star power. In addition to Daniel Craig, the film's cast included heavy hitters like Anna de Armas, Jamie Lee Curtis, Tony Collette, Chris Evans, Don Johnson, Jaden Martell, Michael Shannon, Catherine Langford, and Ricky Lindholm. Lakeith Stanfield also turned in a memorable performance in Knives Out as Detective Lieutenant Elliot, while Noah Segan made a lasting impression as Trooper Wagner. Fortunately, Glass Onion and Knives Out Mystery seems to have assembled a similarly impressive ensemble of actors. Not only will Glass Onion center once again around Craig's Benoit Blanc, but the long-awaited Knives Out sequel will also introduce viewers to a new lineup of eccentric characters. Indeed, while no Knives Out cast members outside of Craig are expected to appear in Glass Onion, the new film's cast does feature recognizable stars. This includes Kate Hudson, Edward Norton, Catherine Hahn, Dave Bautista, Ethan Hawke, Madeline Klein, Jessica Henwick, Leslie Odom Jr., and Janelle Monet. Plus, spoiler alert for what will likely be fun cameos, the film will mark the final on-screen appearances of two late legends, Stephen Sondheim and Angela Lansbury. In other words, it seems safe to say that Glass Onion has managed to successfully steal, at the very least, one page from its predecessor's playbook. Glass Onion A Knives Out Story is just like the original Knives Out was. Rated PG-13. 
The film's rating is reportedly due to strong language, drug content, some violence, and sexual material. Taking that into account, it sounds like Glassonium will be a bit edgier and more mature than some parents may be comfortable with. For whatever it's worth, 2019's Knives Out was rated PG-13 for drug material, brief violence, sexual references, some strong language, and thematic elements. In other words, it sounds like Glass Onion will have worse language and sexual references than Knives Out did. Whether or not Glass Onion ends up being considerably darker in tone and content than Knives Out, however, remains to be seen. Parents should nonetheless note the differences between the two films' PG-13 ratings if they're debating whether or not to take their kids to see Glass Onion later this year.